Here's a problem from the AP Calculus exam. We want to find the area of the shaded region right here between these two curves. I've labeled this red curve as y2 is 5x minus x squared and the green curve right here is y1 equal 2x. So I want to find the area between those two curves. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go to some point here on the x-axis x and then I'm going to go up to the curve and draw in my little test rectangle. So that test rectangle is going to look like this. And it's going to have a thickness of dx because it's got a horizontal thickness like that. And then it's going to have a height of this um, y2 minus y1. So the height of that is going to be y2 minus y1, where y2 is this red curve that's on top and y1 is the green curve that's on the bottom. So let's take a look at what we have for an element of area. The element of area right there is going to be y2 minus y1, the height of that rectangle times its thickness dx. So the total area is going to be what I, what I get when I integrate from 0 right here over to this point right here. Okay, I'm not sure what that is yet, so I'm going to fill that in in a minute. y2 minus y1, so 5x minus x squared, subtract 2x dx. Okay, so let's go up now and see if we can fill in this top limit of integration. That's going to be where these two um, curves right here intersect, so it's going to be at the point 2x is equal to 5x minus x squared. Let's put this in standard form. x squared, subtract 5x from both sides, minus 3x is equal to 0. I'll factor that. x times x minus 3 equals 0. So you can see they intersect here at 0 and here at 3. So I'm going to integrate that from 0 up to 3. So let's see, I'm going to take it back up over here. Let's see what we get. So I've got the integral from 0 to 3 of 5x minus x squared minus 2x. So 3x minus x squared dx. When I simplify inside that, um, uh, inside the integral right here, so what am I going to get when I integrate here? 3 x squared over 2 minus x cubed over 3, all evaluated between 0 and 3. So I'll plug in 3. 3 squared is 9 times 3 is 27 over 2 minus 3 to the third power is going to be 27 over 3 minus what I get when I substitute in 0, which is just going to be 0. So let's see, I have 3 times 27 minus 2 times 27, all divided by 6. When I multiply this by 3 over 3, and this one by 2 over 2, and so what's that? 3 27s minus 2 27s is just 27, divided by 6. Both of those are divisible by 3, so 9 uh, halves. So it looks like the area of that shaded region is going to be 9 halves. Let's go back to our multiple choice question uh, right here, the possible answers. And there I see I have 9 over 2 for my answer. So pretty simple, straightforward problem. Some um, equations right here are pretty easy to deal with. Nice points of intersection right here. Very straightforward. All you have to do is draw in that little test rank rectangle. See that that height is this curve, the equation for this curve, minus the equation for this curve. Its thickness is dx, and then I'm going to integrate from here all the way over to here, so from 0 to 3. So it turns out to be a pretty easy thing to integrate like this. Do a little bit of arithmetic, the answer comes out to be 9 halves.